Welcome back, folks, to Bionic Commando. Welcome back. This is the first episode. Well, I guess this is the first episode. <laughs> well, Probably anyway. not the first time they've been on my channel. So. Well, anyway, we're kind of doing this on the spur of the moment. We were going to do an Xbox 360 game, folks, but we don't really have the cables for it, unfortunately. So, we're playing Bionic Commando for the PlayStation 3. Soon with the cables. Well, we're playing this with the cables today, but soon we'll be playing the Xbox 360 game. It won't take us too long to get through this one. Indeed, we should get to quite a few levels done Seal. this time. Go with this one using our tentacle, and we'll just play it on normal, it's hard enough. Ah, uh, the probing tentacle. And this is the last time you'll see this loading screen, because it comes up quite a bit, folks. Indeed. So. And it takes a long time to go away. So I'll be cutting these out. Enjoy it while you can. Enjoy the wiggling. I like to think of them as eyeballs, honestly. The analog sticks. <clears throat> Indeed. tell you about the man I met when I was still young. Ten years ago, our country faced the greatest threat it had ever known. The FSA was attacked by the Imperials, a military group of fascists who respected nothing, not even the laws of life and death. A soldier was sent in and managed to stop them. He saved us all. He saved me. But people forget. First, the public was grateful, then he grew distrustful. Before long, they turned on people like him. Mechanically enhanced soldiers, bionic commandos. They called them dangerous, crazy, not fully human. Bionics became a public menace. Eventually, the politicians pulled the plug. Bionic soldiers were purged, stripped of their bionic parts like they were machines. Some of them died. Others ran. And the man that saved my life. He ended up on death row for the murders of men I had sent him to kill. Sentenced to death. And ready for the end. This is where our story begins. So as you can tell folks, this game is not the happy-go-lucky <laughs> game that the first game was. No, it's pretty serious. But we're still a bad enough dude to save the president, of course. Of course. God, that grin is ugly. <laughs> well, we gotta have some product placement there. <laughs> a lot of product placement in this game. Let him go. So this is our commanding officer, Steve Bloom. No! AKA, guy with a mustache. You put me in prison in the first place! I follow your orders! I got you out! What the hell do you want with me? Probionic terrorists detonated a weapon of mass destruction in Ascension City this morning. People are dead, Spencer. Hundreds of thousands. Maybe millions. What's left of the city has been occupied. Infantry, Air Force. Nothing we've sent in has come back out. We need to get behind their lines and find out what's going on. I'm not a soldier of the FSA anymore. We believe the terrorists to be ex-Imperials and some of our own men. Rogue Bionics. You're the only one with experience tackling both. We're sending you into the city to scout the area and help us track down those who spy hell you are. I'm just a man, Spencer. I can't give you the last five years back, but I can give you this. What the fuck does this have to do with Emily? I have information about her disappearance. I can help you find her. The clock is ticking on the Spencer. Are you in or out? We've still got one problem. That's been taken care of. 
Oh my god, that missile's been armed! It's a terrible joke! <laughs> and yet, so true. So instead of letting someone else get experience buying Biox, they're going to use the only asset that has experience going up against Biox, you know? You know, I didn't really see any too many Bionic soldiers while we were playing. Oh, when we were doing our test runs? Yeah. Well, we did see some mechanical Monster units. The, the big robot thingies. <laughs> You're spoiling it, damn it! Permission to launch delivery. <gasps> Those big robot thingies. I mean, spoiler alert. There's a little bit of product placement, just a little bit. Just a little bit. Package delivered. Jokes on them, they'll already buy NVIDIA products. <laughs> like flying first class. It actually reminds me a lot of uh, Quake 4. <laughs> Rest Does it get shot in with a rocket? Yeah, we have flying coffins in this game, too. Yeah. But anyway, folks, we're finally to the gameplay, which is where this game really shines. I mean, the story's kind of pants on head, but as far as the <laughs> gameplay's concerned, it's gold. So There's going to be some uh, collectibles around here. We'll probably only get them in this level, unless they're in our way. I am Spencer, motherfucker. That's who I am. We don't have to reload, thankfully. Got one of them extended mags. And as you can tell, I don't even have to aim, really. Just as long as he's in that circle. I can actually aim it <laughs> like that. Don't forget there are challenges for aiming. Oh, yeah, that's right. We're all here, Overwatch. What's that? It's the guy who's shooting at us. Should we shoot him back? Eh, maybe. Is that headshot? Yeah, when it makes that little ding. Or maybe I just shot a column. Who knows? Let's get that. Still That's got. ammo. Yes, you still got the ammo, Spencer. Spencer. <laughs> Spencer. Ah, <laughs> uh, Spencer. Who's Spencer? These guys are already dead. Take all that junk. Do we get a collectible? Um. Is that the noise I just heard? No, we didn't. <laughs> Believe oh, me, no. you'll know it's obnoxious. <laughs> There's one. See? Oh. What the hell? Same noise that goes off for everything. You have obtained stuff. Woo, stuff. Okay, so like you just saw down there, folks, there are challenges. I didn't hit it quick enough, so I'm actually going to have to cycle to it. Let's see. Close up. Shoot an enemy while zoomed in. I think, uh, you already did that one, didn't you? Yeah, I didn't do it when I had the challenge, though. Ah. We get certain things for doing challenges. Sometimes it's just more challenges. Sometimes it's ammo or extra... Sometimes it's what? moves. Ammo capacity, I guess it would be. Come on, people. There you go. There we go. See, so you complete it. Oh my Hooray. god. Thank goodness I'll only be getting these stupid collectibles in this stage. Indeed. Because that wouldn't get obnoxious quick. No. And they are everywhere. You'll see them throughout the game, too. I'm... We got you right there. Right now you're probably saying, but this gameplay sucks lethal, it's just a third person shooter. That'll change. As soon as we get a certain attachment, if you, <laughs> I might say. You see that taser, that, that actually hurts quite a bit. <laughs> I'll be running screaming from that a lot. Because I do like to get up close and personal in this game. I actually am playing right now, if, I, if we haven't mentioned it, and I don't think we have. No, we, I don't think we have either. Lethal's in control. Yes, I know it's unexpected. There's a fucking arm in this thing! So we're about to go through the torch tutorial. We will cut that out for you guys. This is it's pretty boring hurt. stuff. I've got some killer shoes on, Spencer. Look at those things. <laughs> Iron boots. Emily? Like Steve Bloom back there, he's all, I love my fucking job. <laughs> he's in laughing. 
He's just standing there with a smug smile on his face. That'd be hard. And we can't even do that yet. I know, right? They're teasing me. <laughs> it happens that way with a lot of our moves, folks. We'll get them eventually. But we can't reel people in just yet. But soon! And when we can, oh man, it will be glorious. Alright, so I got a couple of new challenges. Swinging and kicking people. And punching people. Oh. Let's see, where am I at? Not up there, apparently. Oh, we'll just use the waypoints. <laughs> oh, oh, Jesus. Oh. You see that collectible there? We're going to completely not get that. Oh, yeah! So here's the main gameplay mechanic. Swinging. Got to get the shit. Uh oh Ooh, got it. Swinger! Let's see, and I can probably get another challenge real quick. If I leap up. There we go, kind of. Did you get it? Uh, I'm just gonna guess I did. I'll eventually get that once I begin. We got the real end. I didn't even mean to do that. And folks, a loading screen. As soon as I can get in this fucking pipe. <laughs> Pipe's giving you some gun. Look at all that radiation. Yeah, you haven't seen the tutorial. We can't swing on this stuff as radiation cooties or something. Our, our <laughs> hand just doesn't like to grab onto it. It's radiation dust. has some frame rate issues on the PlayStation 3 we've learned. So just something we'll have to deal with, unfortunately. Yeah. Shit. Holy shit. Watch out, watch out. Don't want to get in the head hit in the head with that shit. That'd be an unfortunate way to end the game. I know, right? What happened? We got hit in the head. <laughs> Did we send in our super soldier who's supposed to be awesome in every way? What happened to him? <laughs> Himself in the head, like a jackass. Also, I did not mean to get that. I'm sorry, folks. <laughs> He's just struggling with his arm right now. Stuff is harder than it looks. Don't you take that shit out of me. Every can heavy punch it. <laughs> Yeah, eventually I'll be able to knock people up in the air, but as you see there, I got light armor now, which is fantastic. Blood trial. So a lot of times, when we get to the waypoint, we, uh, there's a loading screen. So, flashes, you know why. Just trying to see what the hell blood trial was. I have no idea, I must have completed that one. Hello! Uh-oh. Robots? Robots? Those things that we spoiled earlier. Where the hell am I supposed to go? I gotta get across there somehow. To the waypoint! Huh. Oh, I didn't see this. <laughs> Come on, jump, Spencer. You just gotta lift your knees, man. Oh yeah, I can pick up stuff, too. Oh, not yet. I guess I can swing at it. <laughs> <laughs> I'll beat you, Ammo. Oh, maybe I can if I use L2. So unsuspecting. Hey guys, look! <laughs> look at that guy who's shooting you. <laughs> that didn't work. Right in the back. Anybody else? Yep, I see him down there. Wish I had some of my better skills, so it'd be more interesting for you folks at home. Or even a grenade. Come to get you. <laughs> right into the relay. All right, hard now. left. Now I can hack shit, folks. I use my hacking tentacle. 
Let's see what we got here. Heads up to downtown groups. Task Force 49, who is ordered to investigate the unidentified crash in Sector 23, has not reported back. And they're not responding to communications. It's probably radiation interfering with radio transmission, but let's not get sloppy. The FSA bastards might be trying to infiltrate our perimeter. Stay focused. What else we got? Oh my goodness. That's a long one. <laughs> Vedstat Communications Relay has three main functions. Communications, Mapping, and Information Harvest. Communications. The Fedstat is primarily used to provide a reliable and effective communications uplink. The relay can withstand enormous physical stress, making it the optimal field operation communication device. Mapping. The Fedstat emits a regular sonar pulse that bounces back to the relay for processing. These readings are analyzed and translated into, holograph into a holographic 3D model of the relay's immediate surroundings. Information Harvest The FedStat has been equipped with a SpongeTech 4 information harvest software. This software has the ability to intercept almost any kind of digital signal and store it in the relay's memory bank. So how are these susceptible to tentacles though? Yep, the information tentacles. I didn't get to do my... But you'll get plenty of that in the future, folks. <laughs> Be advised that the floating proximity mine perimeter has been set up in zones R7 to R15. Personnel seeking to proceed through this area should contact that area command center and have them deactivate the mines. Clearance delta or higher is required for approval. Unauthorized use of nearby FedStat communications relays to override uh, activation is strictly forbidden. Alright, so we're done there. We can get back to the game, folks. So those things are pretty much there for us to swing on. Report, soldier. The floating mines. The city's deserted and flooded with radiation. You never mentioned that in the briefing. Remember that your bionics are extremely sensitive to radiation. Now get on with the mission and see what's out there. All right, boss. My readings indicate that something is blocking your only way through. Is that is that a monorail car? Yep, sure is, boss. Sure is, Deep Bloom. <laughs> You've recalled the rip ability. Wow, I remember how to do this. So this is pretty much how it works, folks. We'll remember these abilities, and then we can use them. Yeah, but we can't use them until we remember them. Whoa, buddy. Whoa, 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 whoa. I got to grip onto it before I can do that. Huzzah! <laughs> that you know how this goes, You know how this goes, Oh, boy. <laughs> We're updating the navigation point. Oh, stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Real time. Following nav points will always keep you on the right track. So we do have regenerating health, so we just have to hide for a while if we get hit too much. Come here, you! Take a sit down. Wee! <laughs> <laughs> now we get to have some fun, folks. Wait till we get one of our next abilities, too. That should be a little while down the road, but I'm having enough fun as it is. <laughs> Come here, you! People. You know what? I'm a punch dropping. <laughs> yep. There you go. I didn't want to fly him behind, fly, fly behind me. God oh. damn it, I hate when that happens. having trouble tracking your position. The enemy jamming signal is blocking the homing device we placed on you. See if you can find the relays emitting that signal and shut them off. Hmm. Then we'll be able to triangulate your position. Jesus, and shut why up. I want you to do that. Because we'll be able to resupply you through insertion pods of new weapons. I can live with that. Good. We got a fix on the closest relay. Follow the navigation points. See it? I see it, Steve Bloom. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Fuck your couch. Come here, you. Up the couch. Hey. Joe, I just saw something. A guy flying. It was the name of a terrorist organization. It said Bio, Bio Rain. Rain. Just as we expected. It's the Bio Rain Militia. I'll prepare a file on it. You'll have it shortly. Not oh. the Bio-Rain Militia. Fantastic. Are you going to send me the file through one of those rockets? That'd be pretty neat. That would be pretty cool. Ah, the floating mines. Mm. Mines. Those mines must be controlled by a central network. Maybe you can shut them down by hacking the enemy's relays. This is ridiculous. These things serve no purpose at all, folks. <laughs> what the hell do they block? Nothing. Just us. Just Spencer, us. Listen up. Secretary of Defense Armstrong is calling the shots on this mission. If he contacts you, try to be polite, okay? Nope. I do what I want. 
all those flying cars that are driving through the city right now. Oh god. Don't worry, we don't have to worry about fall damage. Hooray! Hmm. Who goes the yuck? Hey, I'm trying to admire the advertising, <laughs> buddy. I don't even know where you are. He's behind the truck. Oh, that little rascal. Come here. There you go. Don't even take that shit out. <laughs> oh, what'd you give me? A new file. No, 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 it's a grenade. Oh. You also got a new file. Oh. Eh. Files. By the way, what happened to the guys that went to investigate that crash? Last thing I heard was the comlink was broken. Someone killed them? No, moron. It's the radiation. It interferes with the comm channels. I see. If anything came down, we would know about it, right? Yeah, and you might have noticed. Ain't shit coming down here. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even see what grabbed that guy. That was like a fucking bang shot right there. It was. It went all the way around the thing and everything. Oh, I'm getting stuck. Thankfully he didn't shoot. Spencer's happy with his work though, so that's all that matters. Was that him laughing? I thought that was the other guy screaming. No, no, no. It was him laughing. Hmm. I guess I'll get this. First two collectible. Since it's just there. Where the hell am I going? Right there. Ah, uh, yeah. You guys see anything? Nope. Oh, there's guys behind me. Yes, there is. Could you guys please leave without a fuss? Thank you. Don't forget to use a grenade to get a challenge, too. Ah, oh, I have plenty of challenge. <laughs> plenty of time for that. Come on, Spencer. At least try a little bit. Come here, you. Nope, right in the jaw. Yeah, I can't pick those up. Okay. <laughs> He's molesting it. Let's see. Subject downtown situation. Our perimeter has been infiltrated by some guy with an arm. Intel on the enemy is currently minimal. We don't know if he has an arm, though. But all hands are to be at the highest alert. Uh. All suspicious activities must be investigated and dealt with accordingly. Polygraph, polycraft troop carriers are on standby and ready to move out to provide reinforcements. Fantastic. Well, I'm glad they have shit on hand. Hooray! Ah, uh, look at that guy. <laughs> One of the Tron bots. Indeed. <laughs> look at that guy. <laughs> I don't know why that tickles me, Zeppi, but it does. Uh, he's so happy. Good job, Spencer. We only need one more relay, then we'll have your position. Oh boy, these things scare the fuck out of me. Hope I'm going the right way. Looks like it. Yep. Oh, I see it. And of course, the collectibles are right out in the open. Just ask. I get the suits of the polygraphs. What's the deal with the floating mines? What's the deal with airline food? Countermeasures against low altitude flyers. You know, helicopters, recon drones. If the FSA sends anything skyward, we'll blow the shit out of it. Oh, will you now? I don't even know where these guys are. Well, oh, I guess that are. explains it a little bit. Here we go. Aha! Come on, guys. Cluster up all nice and pretty like. Kaboom! Did you get them all? Nice. Yep. And we got an ammunition upgrade for that. Spencer, you've been without your arm for a long time. Bionic parts usually take some time to synchronize with the bearer. Your point being? My point being, don't expect to jump straight back into the old days. Certain moves and techniques will come back. Just give him some time. Oh, oh God! <laughs> Steve Bloom, so you're not helping, Steve Bloom. So I got one to do like five in a row. Not gonna be a huge problem for me once I have the appropriate situation. Hey guys, I'm Batman. Oh, oh. shit balls! Guys, you gotta stop. You gotta stop. You gotta oh. stop. Spencer, you've been without your arm for a long time. Bionic parts usually take some time to synchronize with the bearer. Your point being? My point being, don't expect to jump straight back into the old days. All right, Steve Blue, you're not helping. Techniques will come back. Just give him some time. Come here, you piece of shit. Think you're cute? You're dead now. Fuck you. All dead. All the time. 
pretty good jumper, this guy, but he does have bionic legs, I suppose. Indeed, don't forget those guys below you. Yep, down by the relay. Indeed. I don't have any more of those fancy grenades, so I'm just gonna have to find my normal. Hey, buddy! We're in the back. Get out of here. Okay, there's still somebody, buddy. <laughs> I was gonna oh, say somebody around. Come here. Uh, maybe a little bit. <laughs> anyway, the relay knows it's safe now, so it can come out of hiding. For its tentacling. Rear defense! Perfect oh. for tentacles. <laughs> <laughs> so, attention pilots! During the recent live combat training session, a bullet ricocheted and hit the rear venting outlet of a biomech. The result was a serious malfunction in the biomech's set power source. The mechanic... Uh, Yenna Yenero, whatever his name is, was up all night fixing it. The venting outlet is a sensitive spot on the biomech combat suit. Maybe the only one. All measures should be taken to protect it. Never turn your back towards incoming fire. I mean, that's sort of, even if you're not in a biomech, that's pretty good advice. <laughs> and cover each other, goddammit. Who does that? Who turns their back on that? Sponge tech, huh? So this is stuff they picked up from the field. Let's see. Format treatment initialized. Audio to text. Hey, Matthews, do you know anything uh, about what's going downtown? There's some rumor that an FSA special ops force has gotten into the city. Any truth to that rumor? Seems like it, but you know what? What really confuses me is that they managed to hack into our relays. Hack the relays? Is that even possible? I've heard, I, I've heard of the relays can't be hacked at all. No, not by a normal person. That's why I'm confused. And another. Oof. <laughs> Good. We've acquired your position on radar. We'll update the mission parameters. In the meantime, proceed through the city. We need to know what they're up to. Oh god, we're on radar. Uh-oh. Yeah, I can't uh -oh. see. Oh, fish. Alright, let's try this shit again. Good. We've acquired your position on radar. We'll update the mission parameters. In the meantime, proceed through the city. We need to know what they're up to. You kinda need to take your time on these things if I haven't proven it. Come on! Although I'm not gonna get any speed swinging with this, <laughs> with that plan. Wait! There we go! There we go! Good thing it does not blow up. I know, right? Well, they are deactivated now. That's true. They aren't covered on with electricity, as it were. Maybe. Spencer, we loaded the first pod with a hiker. It's in the air now. Poor guy. <laughs> How did you do that? Also, I land on the ground like a jackass. What are we supposed to do with a hiker? Looked like poo drop. <laughs> <laughs> it did look like poo drop. It still does. <laughs> Oh, that's a juvenile humor. There's nothing but shit here. New. They call it a hiker. It packs a fierce punch with a good spread. Not exactly subtle. Hmm. I'll take it. I said I'll take it. This there is not a mountain man. Two hit wonder. Gotta hit two people with this thing at once, which is harder than it sounds. Gotta right. kill him with one shot. Oh boy. Thing. Where the hell am I going? Oh, I see him down there. Hmm. Maybe if I swing from this. Whoops, sorry. Didn't mean to grab you like that. Let's see if I can line you up. I said no. Uh-oh. Oh crap, I don't have my weapon now. <laughs> I like how they get stuck in a run. Oh, come on. There we go. Okay, over there? Yep. Oh, wrong one. Wrong one. Better just shoot him. Alright, Seth Green, you'll find me. Get out of here, you kids. Yeah, kids. Very inspirational music at this point. Yeah, I like that music, just got epic. Jolly, you're saving the world from terrorism. Product placement. <laughs> Thanks for actually getting on there, Spencer. <laughs> That's nice. Hey guys. 
shot around him, unfortunately, and killed the guy in back of him, but not him. Oh boy, that's actually perfect. No, no dying, no dying, no dying, no, 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 no. That was a close one. I know, I'm, I'm trying to show off for the viewers. I'm not really this bad at the game. <laughs> also, I'm out of hiker ammo now. No, or hiker. I require additional boots. Uh, come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. There we go. Get out of here, you. There's too many. I know, right? Rascals. Okay, gotta be careful with these things. Blow up. There it goes. <laughs> Took it a second. Did you get anybody? I got go. one of them. Don't you even try that fucking bullshit with me. No. Yeah. One guy left. Is there? No, that was him. Okay. Because I don't see you on the minimap. Hmm. Not epic anymore. What's going on? Ah. Oh yeah. Let's just show him it. Recall an ability. Incoming! Spencer Smash! Whoa, nice move. I wouldn't want to be caught in that shockwave. Oh, we will use it. This is Secretary Armstrong. Status report. I'm in the middle of something, Secretary. Maybe you could ask Joe. I outrank you both, Major. And don't you forget it. You report to me at my say-so. Fine. Here's the report. The city is in ruins. Everybody's dead. Is that what you were looking for? Oh, spare me the melodrama. I'll be checking in on you, Major. I run this mission. Not don't <laughs> don't mind me, Armstrong. I'm just kicking ass. <laughs> Not a big deal. You just shut up. I'm trying to kick some ass. I will use other moves when I get them, by the way, folks. We don't have really much to use right now. Yeah, I haven't recalled them yet. Don't do that. It's rude. Kind of blessed it. There we go. Had to find the ports. Let's see, more sponge tech stuff, huh? Awesome, my turn. Oh, what do we have? All right. Red Neon sign says Gladys, southeast, about a click away. I see it. Oh, you're never going to make it, man. Oh, ye of little faith. And then we hear some gunfire. Holy shit, nice shot. Who's your daddy? Your turn. So they're having a little shooting competition. Let's see. Crash site update. Lieutenant, we've reached the crash crash site. The crash site? There's no fucking H in there, goddammit. <laughs> Lieutenant, we've reached the crash site. The aircraft seems to be a manned FSA, FSA recon plane. However, if they uh, were planning to land, they never did. The plane crashed right into the building wall. We're trying to find a safe route up there, but it's going to take a while. I'll report further fi findings ASAP. Spencer, incoming paratroopers. Watch out. Paratroopers. Where are you? Above us. Poo drop. Oh, there's a poo drop? Where's the poo drop? Poo drop. They're behind you. Right there. Oh. Well, I don't want to forget the poo. Ooh, more hiker. Maybe I can get that challenge. Alright, folks. This is going to be it for today. See you next time.